Hello everybody, welcome to this first video tutorial about the viscous flow around an airfoil. In today's video, I'm going to describe you what this project is about. Uh, we're going to have uh, an overview uh, of the main uh, three steps uh, and uh, to perform the aerodynamic analysis of uh, uh, the flow around uh, a NACA four-digit series airfoil. That's one small step for man. So first, uh, we're going to see how to construct uh, the geometry of a four-digit uh, airfoil, NACA airfoil. So we're going to go through a bit of nomenclature and see what uh, these names you see here uh, are, and uh, how to convert uh, the four-digit uh, airfoil into a actual geometrical shape using some equations that uh, you can find online. So here we have uh, the code and uh, we will obtain uh, the desired shape. Then we're going to use our, we're going to use a Python library called uh, Xfoil, um, which is actually quite famous for students of aerodynamics. And uh, this will help us to uh, calculate the, the um, aerodynamic coefficients, for example, the lift and drag, uh, momentum and uh, pressure coefficients around the airfoil. And uh, we're gonna see it in the case of inviscid flow and viscous flow. So of course, in the case of inviscid flow, uh, non-viscous flow, we don't have a uh, drag. And, uh, and finally, the, the last step will be uh, comparing the calculated uh, aerodynamic coefficients with some uh, um, data obtained from uh, experiments, uh, which uh, we can find online. And I will show you how to actually uh, get this data and import it into Python and then have a comparison of the inviscid viscose and experimental data. So I hope you guys are ready and let's get started. 